2 2 pitch. And a fly ball to right center field. That's going to drop for a hit. And Bobble, McCutcheon's throw. The runner breaks for the plate. Here's the throw. Wow. He is out. The Buckos win it. Raise the Jolly Roger. 1 1 pitch. Little broken bat. A flare. Out to shallow left. Cosma is there. The Cardinals have win number 92. <laughs> I'm Eric Heiss with the MLB.com FastCast. The Pittsburgh Pirates clinched a postseason berth on Monday with a 2-1 win over the Cubs and a little help from the Cardinals. After Starling Marte sent out a go-ahead solo shot in the top of the ninth and some drama in the bottom of the ninth that saw the Bucks nab a runner at the plate to end the game, the Pirates were finally able to celebrate a playoff berth only after the Cardinals put away the Nationals 4-3. Pittsburgh is now guaranteed at least a wild card spot. And so are the Reds, who also earned a postseason spot with the Cards' victory over the Nationals and a 3-2 walk-off win over the Mets. Shinsu Chu delivered the game-winning hit for Cincy with an RBI single in the 10th. Pittsburgh and Cincinnati remain tied for the top spot in the NL wildcard race and also remain two games back of St. Louis in the NL Central. As the aforementioned Redbirds helped out their division rivals with a 4-3 win over the Nationals, eliminating Washington from a postseason berth. Carlos Beltran swatted out a two-run home run in the win, backing seven-plus innings of three-run ball from Adam Wainwright. James Loney gets it done, and the Rays are still in first place in the wild card with six to go. James Loney's pinch hit walk-off home run in the ninth carried the Rays onto a 5-4 win and four-game series sweep of the O's. The victory has Tampa Bay a full game up on Idol Cleveland for the top spot in the AL wild card. The Orioles, who are now five games back of the second spot in the AL wildcard race, were dealt more bad news in the loss as Manny Machado was carted off the field in the seventh with a left knee injury. Alex Rios has hit for the cycle. Alex Rios hit for the cycle, and Derek Holland tossed a six-hit shutout as the Rangers roughed up the Astros 12-0. The victory has Texas one game behind Idol Cleveland for the second spot in the AL wildcard race. Salvador Perez's RBI double in the 12th led the Royals past the Mariners 6-5. KC is now three games back of Idol Cleveland in the battle for the second spot in the AL wildcard race. After Brian Dozier hit out a game-tying home run in the ninth, Yasmiel Pinto came up clutch for the Twins with a walk-off RBI single in the 11th, lifting Minnesota over Detroit 4-3. The Tigers' magic number to win the AL Central remains at two. The A's ousted the Angels 10-5. Jed Lowry hit out a three-run rip in the triumph that has Oakland just one game back of Idol Boston for home field advantage in the playoffs. Marco Estrada, who was backed by three homers, fired seven scoreless frames and fanned six to lead the Brewers by the Braves 5-0. Despite the loss, Atlanta still owns the best record in the National League. Nathan Eovaldi allowed just three hits in seven and two-thirds scoreless as the Marlins blanked the Phillies 4-0. Phillies starter Roy Halladay exited the game after just 16 pitches in the first with right arm fatigue. Nick Hundley's three-run home run in the sixth powered the Padres past the D-backs 4-1. And the White Sox edged the Blue Jays 3-2. Jose Quintana earned the W, allowing just two runs in seven and a third. For complete highlights from all the action on Monday, stay locked to MLB.com. It's baseball everywhere.